I'm Dana Yalomi, and I am the founder and the director of Public Movement, and we investigate public choreographies in public spaces, and certain kind of events that are combining art and politics, and the performance of them both. I, the general role is that I am part of the group that started uh, to think about this event, and. Uh, have been in the process of discussing it for a year and a half together with the Baltic Circle. Uh, I'm also the conductor of this evening, so for the specific for the summit. I, uh, I set the rules uh, of the evening and um, have been communicating with the different politicians about uh, their presentations and uh, constructing the list of questions for the politicians that are the basis for the presentation tonight. It's, it looks like a summit and it acts like a summit and there are politicians in space um, but there are some kind of artistic means or tools that are creating a different kind of relationship between a, yeah, a listener. As a public you receive uh, two cards, there is a blue card that uh, asks the politicians to be concrete. This means they should give an example or explain what they mean, or you get a white card which uh, says that, or asks the question why, which I think is much more ideological. Today we are there, public and politicians, to understand better what each party stands for when it comes to art policy. What will they vote uh, for when they are in the parliament as coalition or as opposition? Um, this evening, the summit in general is a workshopping situation. It's not a moment that you can, um, as a public, say, yeah, I'm for, you know, this basic salary for artists or I'm against. It, it's, it's really not, um, there is no space really for the public to interfere or kind of perform their um, pre-decided positions, uh, but it's an arena where they can engage in the discussion itself. <laughs>